Hey guys, this is Woods, and today we're gonna discuss the damage reduction in the game. Now, here is the post on Reddit by the principal designer for Remnant 2. So I'm going to break it down into a couple of pieces that way you know exactly what is going on. In any case, the post is about a page long, so I will leave a link in the description. That way you can just go and check it out for yourself. But before we go any further, I'll give you the TLDR. Do not trust the stat sheets in game. It is not correct. So do not beat yourself over it. The devs know about this issue and they plan to fix it. That's the TLDR. That say the first segment of the post that I am going to break down for you is right here on screen. Update. 7 august 2023 we identified an issue with fortify granting too much dr it was giving both armor dr while also purely modifying incoming damage which is even beyond normal damage reduction since it was fixed players were noticing they were taking more damage than they felt they should so basically players are frustrated because they feel like before the patch they were good to go but now after the patch they feel like they are taking more damage than they think they are supposed to take so to explain this any further what they say so what is happening is players are saying they are above 80 percent which is the max damage reduction that you can have in the game i will show you this in game once we're done with this due to the additive display which should be multiplicative and thus they feel they have enough total damage reduction however behind the scenes they have less than it shows so they are saying that we fixed this in our build we will also be reviewing the damage reduction values across the board to see if some need an increase but mathematically speaking damage reduction is working as intended but the visualization on event stats is completely misrepresenting the damage reduction you actually have again tldr do not trust the stat sheets in game so the last part i'm gonna go over is what they say right here mathematically speaking not considering the misrepresented text in event stats damage reduction is working as designed this does not mean we won't be making some adjustments so players can get to the damage cap a bit easier basically as we review the values that we may find it worth buffing different damage reduction values to allow players to get to the cap in a variety of ways instead of just stacking a b c d o items now before i go in game to put this into context for you guys let's see what they say they are trying to do so they say all of these adjustment will be in the next patch so be patient so just say stay updated on the biggest issues here so if you have read it and if you go to the link there's also on the page this link right here that's something that happens three days ago which they already talked about the damage reduction and all that stuff but they wanted to reiterate this in this current post that way people feel at ease because there's a lot of confusion going on so as you can see in the previous uh, post that they have they talk about the damage reduction and then they also talk about some other stuff a lot of things that they are fixing so if you want to read all the stuff so know that all these things should be resolving when we have the patch on console so if you want to go read this just go ahead so right now i am going to go in game so we're going to just put everything into context when it comes to damage reduction all right guys we are currently in game and i am on my character screen but bear in mind i'm still in the old build we don't have any update yet on console so this is where we are so if i pull up the advanced stat sheet this is the shit that i was telling you guys do not trust that shit when it comes to the damage reduction as you can see my total damage reduction is 38.5 percent and also as you can see in the tooltip it says that the maximum you can get is 80 percent but a lot of people are stacking out of damage reduction and when it comes to armor and other buffs and they go over that 80 percent so they could be over a hundred or so whatever that number might be so they feel like they should not be taking any damage but the reason why this is happening is because of the straight right here that is called fortify so when you have fortify so for instance if you have the engineer um archetype equipped so you'll be at 50 percent 
armor effectiveness that would give you a very big number so for example if i go and equip my uh engineer since it is maxed as you can see when i go to the trait with my fortify i am at 50 percent armor effectiveness so if we go to the advanced stat sheet as you can see my number goes from 38 to 58 so now i got a lot more damage reduction than i had before because with the fortify trait you get all this they saying that the fortify trait is messing with your damage numbers that you see on screen so they fix it on their bill meaning they are going to have to patch this that way you can see the correct number so if you see your number is increased of over 100 or so then do not trust this number so it is less than what you see now that is what was happening before the patch because they were seeing so big numbers and uh, they think they should not be taking any damage but in reality the numbers is not what it seems that's the gist of everything hopefully this explains everything to you guys thank you guys for watching i will see you guys in the next one